moms that are real, they lay it out there, they tell you the truth, they make me feel so much better about myself. Please welcome Kat and Nat, the special couple. Yeah. 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 Let's do a fake high five. Yeah. 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 And a real high five. Yeah. She yeah, no, yeah. I mean, there's too many people in her life touching her. So if you don't know these two ladies, uh, Kat and Nat, they have seven kids between them, okay? And they do everything together, but they do have husbands. Mm -hmm. yeah, and our own homes. People ask all the time, all right? All the time. Now, you started um, doing this amazing thing, and this is when I fell in love with you both, called Mom Truths. Yeah. And it's all about, you know, different topics, school lunches. Yep. It can be about involvement in the schools. It could just be about the way life is with kids. Got it. And your Mom Truth videos have been so incredibly popular. It's all about what moms think. You're one of them yeah. about what moms are really thinking has gone viral. And by viral, I mean 10 million views. Here's a quick peek. Take a look. Mom Truth Friday. This goes on in every mom's head. The hamster wheel. It never freaking stop. You have the best of intentions. You're like, mm. today I'm going to be present. Feed my kids that healthy or Organic chai chia quinoa smoothie. I'm gonna be completely present, put my phone down, and I'm gonna enjoy every single minute. I'm not gonna yell because you know what? I'm just gonna be patient because I'm gonna realize what yelling actually sounds like. I'm gonna use positive yeah. reinforcement. I'm not gonna give her goldfish for breakfast uh and lunch and snack mm -mm. and dinner. I'm gonna make sure that they have well-balanced meals. Like, I'm gonna make sure that oh, there's yeah. vegetables. I'm gonna meal plan, actually. You know, I'm gonna actually meal plan. Meal plan yeah. yeah, I'm gonna meal plan every day so we know, if I don't waste any food for the family, so I'm saving family food. I'm gonna make sure that we lay out their outfits and my own the, the night before. I'm not just gonna eat the leftovers that no. are on the table. My body's a temple and I gotta start showing my kids. Also make sure we do sex at least three times a week. At least, that keeps the relationship strong. You know what, I'm not gonna put too much pressure on myself. That wasn't too much. That's, no, not too much. That's just normal. That's yeah. what all the other moms yeah. do anyways. Yeah, to them. I think if we get that all done and then we go to bed, we won't have to worry about doing it again better the next day. Sex twice a week. Do you do it three, <laughs> three times. Do it. We're talking later about low libido, but it's funny when you've got all of this stuff going through your mind all the yeah. time as a mom, it's really difficult to do everything right yes. and the pressure is real, is it yeah. not? The guilt that you feel every day at the end of the day when you haven't done all the things that you thought you would. Yeah. And it's then you go through social media and everyone's perfect oh, and everyone's perfect. got their like lunches packed perfectly and they look amazing you're like oh my gosh what so there's right. a lot of pressure there's a lot going on well there are all you know there's a lot of people that are faking the funk on social media and I think that's uh, it's good to own it yeah. you know when we when I put out the beautiful shots I'm like and then they started smacking each other right. 30 seconds later so you have the good you're real about the bad mm -hmm. and I think that's phenomenal